But speaking about music, Lone Star. Yeah. That is crazy. <laughs> how, how did all this come about? Well, Joe Campbell from the Mac, he sent some of my videos to Lone Star, and they just approved it, and it went from there. Honestly, wow. it was crazy, yeah. I'm very excited. <laughs> well, do y'all both have like a favorite Lone Star song? You said it earlier. <laughs> I'm already there. <laughs> I, I know people like Amazed, but I'm already there. It's, I'm already oh, it's there. a hits, banger. It hits different. I'm already there. Exactly. It just it just hits different. Take Every time I hear it, yeah. Look around. It's a great. I've never uh, heard their music. I wouldn't take you as a big Lone Star fan. Yeah, I'm it's sorry. okay. <laughs> it's all right. <clears throat> you have to know Amazed though. I don't know how you do what you do. Uh, I'm so yeah, in love yeah, with I know you. it. I've heard it at school. <laughs> oh yeah, that, that <laughs> was back always, in high school. Yeah. That was always the slow dance song yeah. that everybody chose. Yep. Yeah. They what was the other song they had? Mr. Mom. I think that was one of their songs. That they yeah. were ahead of their time. <laughs> Good for a long star. Yeah. Ah, they just make such incredible music, and that's awesome. Yep. They're coming right down to the Mac too, yep. and it's great too how they're letting local people open up. For these big acts, are you nervous, Any? Nope, I'm very excited. <laughs> as soon as I found out, I was like, I'm ready to do this. When do I start practicing? Wow. I'm, I'm happy that you got that confidence and drive. I would be absolutely terrified of this situation. <laughs> in in oh, a way, it's like, well, I'm performing for a national act. Like, it's a huge, huge opportunity, huge band. Like, yeah, it's like crazy, but like, I'm very excited to do it. That makes my stomach drop just hearing you say that. <laughs> like the, the, the term national touring band, like, oh, God. Yeah, <laughs> that's a scary term. Yeah. Uh, do you, like, do you get nervous, Annie? Like, like but before Annie show, like, do you get the butterflies just a little bit? Yeah. At, I feel like everyone does. Anybody that says they don't kind of feel like you might be lying to us a little bit. When does it hit you? Right before you go on. You'll mm. be sitting there, and then just twiddling your thumbs, and then you start thinking about it. Then you're mm. like, oh, I'm about to perform in front of people. <laughs> Mm. Then you're like, huh? It's gonna be hot on stage. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> then, then yeah. My then the pressure starts building off. up, and then when I get on stage, it's like, okay, we're good. I was I, nervous for nothing. How's the uh, Lumix Productions going? Oh, it's going great. I hope, anyways. <laughs> I've been seeing a, a lot of stuff on Facebook here yeah. recently about it. It's, yeah. it's cool to see the the growth. Yeah, I've been uploading a lot on uh, Instagram, uh, YouTube. And my Patreon. i got a lot of stuff going on on Listen, Patreon. she's got these cool like little 3D models on her Instagram, and I love them. They're like little mushrooms. Are they NFTs? No. Okay. No. Are you going to dive into that? Uh, I'm not a... You're thinking about it. She's thinking about it. She's thinking about it. Um, Who kn- I don't know them. I don't know enough about them to like even know what they are. I just know as that they're very popular. The, as somebody in the art community, um, the NFTs, I don't think we claim them. I think a lot of people in the art community have said that they do not claim the people who do the NFT thing. You know, I'm going to be honest. I don't know what an NFT it's is. Very, it's I don't a, know what it is either, really. It's a little controversial. What's an NFT, Brittany? It's a very, it's kind of complicated too to explain. Well, I'm gonna look at the definition. <laughs> look at the definition. Okay, a he's got us. non-fungible token. Okay. That's NFT. It is a unique and non-interchangeable unit of data. Excuse me. Stored on a blockchain, a form of a digital ledger. NFTs can be associated with the reproductible digital files such as photos, videos, and audio. So is it a real thing? Or is it something on the internet? Okay, it's like uh, um, I'm going to try to explain this best way I can because, lord, it's complicated. You know, he said a bunch of stuff and I have no idea what any of it means. I don't know. It, <laughs> yeah, I, even I, that I, kind I of had to take my time moment, reading really it. Do. They were using a lot of big words. From what I've heard, um, it's essentially like people just make like a little... What's the best way to explain this? Like, I'll do a simple one that people do not like. Okay. So there's like, a, they take a, like a little character and just from head up, headshot of them and just draw them multiple times doing different expressions and then they sell them. Oh. And so they post. Yeah. Wait, 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 so, but here's so, the thing. So they post it, it and they don't think people are just going to so, click and save the image. So it's just drawing a bunch of pictures and then selling them. Yes. So in a way that it it is art. 
It is hard, but I think the reason why it's controversial is because people can just hold it in and save the picture, correct? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, like and then they, they can just resell the picture. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, okay. it's complicated. Okay, yeah, it's, it's different than art trade because with art trade, you know, if you're going to post uh, an image, you're supposed to either post a little bit of the image, blur it a little bit, mm-hmm. you know, that put, way. Put your uh, was a watermark. Yeah, watermark. You know, you could do whatever you like. You know, usually photographers put their name in the middle. Yeah. Of the picture. Yeah. Why don't you just do that? Why don't people do that? It's it's in it. It's in it. I, I, NFT, whatever. <laughs> I, I don't get it enough either, but I know that like they are selling for ridiculous amounts of money. I just yeah, that in, too. <laughs> <clears throat> the most expensive NFT is a digital collage of images by people that sold for sixty nine point three million dollars. Yeah, that's why people aren't too happy about it. Whoa! It's you. It's usually too. Like I said, it's usually just a character headshot of a character, and they're just. It doesn't even look. Very cool. Like the well, the, the pictures <laughs> that I'm seeing is it's like pixelated, right? Is that the headshots you're uh, talking what, about? What 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 is the image? I don't know. There's a lot of them, but it's <laughs> like, it's like it's just like it looks like retro Mario characters almost. I feel like we're playing a game trying to guess what he's looking at. <laughs> <laughs> I wish we had a. a, a, a we're going to get a monitor in here one day. I'm going to pull it up on the phone just so y'all can see it. Yeah, Alex just said it's some type of money scheme, which I can see that too. Okay, yeah. You know? Like like this. Oh, that's an NFT. Yeah, oh. essentially. It, yeah, this is what I was talking about for the people at home. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, see, it's like very pixelated and stuff. Yeah. I guess that's a mask. Yeah, and it's just the same. It's just the same. It's just the same character, but with different expressions. So it could be any character. It doesn't have to look like that. Why are they so valuable? I and don't like, know. <laughs> uh, it's just a like, fad. I would get it it's complicated. If it's like, <laughs> like, I would get it if it's like a, a famous artist, you know, painted this yeah. or drew it. But, like, why are you selling a $2 million picture of a character that... Yeah, but as you can see, though, from the picture that they posted, you can literally just click on that image and click save. Yeah. And then you so, have it. Don't even have to buy it. So I, I you guess buy? you get a certificate. And get if a you do that, you get, you get, everybody gets mad. And do you get anything for it? Like when you buy it, do you not get anything? Like, like you said, you, a certificate? You, you, just, you, just, you just have it, <laughs> oh, I guess. That's it? Okay. What, what would make you get involved in the NFT game? Nothing. I, I think <laughs> with, with you being the talented artist that you are, you can knock one of these out in five minutes. Like yeah. this does not look very hard to. Yeah, you could make. achieve that. You could achieve. I could just do like Terry. Do like, like a little headshot of Terry. But like yeah. my great, don't, my don't, bird. don't like sell them for like two million dollars because I don't think you're gonna get much out of that. But like twenty bucks a pop, you know. <laughs> if you sell five of you them, know? that's a hundred bucks. Yeah. I do more like commissions. You know, I like show you know, like an example of art and be like, if you want a full body, you have to pay this price, half this price, the commission. Like people yeah. are like, you tell me what you want me to draw, and I'll do that. Commission style <laughs> NFTs. Listen, Boom. crazy. You can be an NFT. You need to get people while they're dumb and they don't know anything <laughs> about it. Just jump on, jump on that bandwagon and steal people's money just like everybody else <laughs> is right now. Everybody like I got scammed. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah. 